If you're looking for the best folding bikes, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on the features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Schwinn 20-inch loop folding bike. The Schwinn 20-inch loop folding bike is ideal for city commuters. When folded up, it measures 30 x 32 x 11, so it will take up very little space in your apartment or office. The low standover frame is perfect for quickly and easily getting on and off of the bike, and the 7-speed drivetrain allows you to take this bike over hilly terrain. For quick stopping power, the bike is alloy linear pole brakes, full fenders, and a rear cargo rack. The Schwinn Loop includes a nylon storage case for easy carrying and safe storage. The performance of the Schwinn 20 inch Loop folding bike is excellent. The gears are smooth and the frame is durable and has a solid feel even though it is one of the cheapest folding bikes on the market. I found that the bike was easy to fold and unfold and provides a ride just like a normal solid frame bike. The bike performed well over gravel trails and sharp turns, and the small size once folded down will fit in most any trunk, closet, or cluttered garage. The Schwinn 20-inch loop folding bike is our top pick because it has just about everything you would want in a folding bike and is the best folding bike under $200. Moving on to the next at number two with Koala Sports Volador Folding Electric E-Bike. The Koala Sports Volador is similar in frame design to the well-known down with some important feature differences. The biggest is the pedal assist electric drivetrain with a 350W hub motor that has a range of over 25 miles. The Volador integrated the 36V-7 all lithium battery in the seat post so it keeps a streamlined look. Shifting between the gears is accomplished with an easy to use grip shifter. While most folding bikes are mostly for riding on flat terrain, the Volador with its 350W motor and 7 speeds gives it the ability to tackle hills that would be difficult with traditional bike. It has pretty standard 20 aluminum alloy wheels, though it folds down to a manageable compact size of 32x15x26. The Koala Sports has disc brakes for quick stopping power, and with a chromoly frame it weighs only 36 pounds, light enough for most anyone to pick up and carry around. The handlebars and the seat posts have a wide adjustment range and can fit riders up to 6'3". Being a Koala Sports, it features a solid locking mechanism that keeps it locked securely until you want to take it for a ride. The Volador is perfect for everything from commuting to taking it with on your boat. I just would have liked to have seen a carry bag included. The number 3 position is held by Columbia 28 Folding Bike with 18 speeds. The Columbia Folding Bike with Shimano 18 speeds is the perfect bike for those transporting it with their car because it was the largest and heaviest bike we tested. It's probably not one you will want to carry around. When folded down, it measures 38x14x29, x and it fit in just about any vehicle. The bike is recommended for riders who are 5'3 to 6 aero. The bike is lightweight at 35 pounds, and I was able to fold it up in under 10 seconds. The Columbia features a Shimano 18-speed gear system, alloy front and rear V-brakes, removable front handle stem, front slash rear steel rims, and a kickstand. I really like the high quality and larger wheels of the Columbia folding bike. It folds quickly and stays secure, and with 18 gear speeds you can find a speed for a comfortable ride on almost any terrain. I would say the Columbia 26 is the best full-size folding bike. There is some assembly needed, the initial setup is clearly explained in the instructions. I was able to assemble it in less than 10 minutes. If I was going to nitpick, the gears on the bike can be a bit noisy. And like all the other bikes, we tested it lacks a suspension so it's not an ideal bike for off-road use. I also wasn't crazy about the bike stand design, but it works. The Columbia 26 folding bike being lightweight and portable is an ideal camping bike. It can take on most terrain with its 18 speeds. The Columbia 26 is the best folding bike under $300. Next at number 4, we have Volano Urbana Single Speed Folding Bike. The Volano Urbana Folding Bike is an excellent option for riding flat, busy streets. The simple design is one of the Volano's most lightweight folding bikes. The double lock latching system makes the bike easy and safe to transport by utilizing a secondary lock on every latch. This bike also has no brake or shifter cables, resulting in a simplistic, low-maintenance design. Once you fold down the bike, it is held together by a simple magnetic latching system so it doesn't unexpectedly unfold on you. 
At 11.7 x 30 x 25 dimensions when folded down, this bike is perfect for compact storage. Volano is one of the most popular folding bike manufacturers, and the One Speed Uno model doesn't disappoint. It looks more like a BMX bike than the traditional folding bike frame. It is quick and easy to fold and then unfold the bike, making it perfect for traveling on city bus routes and one of the best affordable folding bikes you can buy. One thing I liked best about this bike is the lack of cables and gears. It makes it a convenient, worry-free, and the lightest folding bike on our list. The biggest issue I found is the seat is not as comfortable as other models that were tested, especially over longer distances. The Volano had one of the highest weight limit of the bikes we tested at 200 pounds, which was surprising since it was also the smallest, so I have to attribute it to the solid frame and rims. This bike will bring back days of riding bikes when you were a kid. It's fun to ride and there is almost nothing to break. In my opinion, this is the best folding bike under $500. The Volano Urbana is perfect for commuting around town. The number 5 position is held by King 2 Dual Suspension Folding Mountain Bike. I know what you're thinking, a folding mountain bike. I know I was pretty skeptical when I checked out the King 2. It's actually a pretty well-known name in folding bikes, and the King 2 MTB is actually a pretty decent mountain bike. Now I am not going to tell you can take this down a mountain, where you take a real mountain bike, but it will be able to handle off-road trails with no problem and quite comfortably at that because it has a dual suspension. The front and rear shocks are pretty solid and provide plenty of travel giving you a pretty comfortable ride on rough trails. The King 2 Folding MTB is a 21-speed Shimano gear system that shifts easily and reliably. Having 21 speeds is more than enough for comfortable riding. I rarely use more than 710 speeds. The bike assembles with two tools, a 15 socket wrench and a torque screw for the handlebars. Once assembled, you can unfold and fold it in literally a few seconds. Take a few extra minutes when assembling it. Make sure you line everything up. You will be happy you did later. The bike is heavier than most folding bikes because it needs to be sturdier and the extra weight of the shocks. But even with that, it weighs only 38 pounds. Not bad for a mountain bike. Its max weight capacity is rated at 250 pounds. I think you could probably go over that without too much problem. It folds up to 29 high. 37 long and 13 wide and should fit in most any vehicle and will comfortably ride anyone from 5'3 to 6'2. The King 2 even features disc brakes. This is a pretty nice feature for a folding bike in its price range. This folding mountain bike is excellent for camping. It will handle most trails with ease. I certainly wouldn't push it by taking it on any expert type trails or downhill on say a ski mountain but I think it's the best folding mountain bike available. The number 6 position is dominated by IDS on YO usual U-Transformer folding city bike. Every regular biker is going to travel over wet or muddy terrain at some point. And, if you're in your work clothes, that's kind of a problem. That's why people love the IDS on YO a usual U-Transformer bike. It has tire caps in the front and back to help protect you from road muck. The bike also has 6 speeds and a rack for cargo on the back. A notable downside, though, it's 42 pounds which is pretty hefty, well worth the price a fan road. It folds up easily and can fit in my trunk. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Eurobike 26-inch mountain bike folding bicycle. Want a lot of gears? This bike is a 21-speed shifting system. No, not a typo. It's also a mountain bike, making it idea for hitting the trail and your daily commute. A double-disc braking system also helps keep you safe when you need to stop. The bike is well-designed. It's really easy to fold but rides as sturdy as a non-foldable bike. You can easily fit it in your trunk or backseat. The number 8 position is held by and cheer folding electric mountain bike. Sometimes, you just want to kick back and let your bike do the work for you. That's what you get with the electric and cheer, which allows you to pedal when you want to basically drive when you don't. The 21-speed mountain bike can travel up to 15 miles per hour and has sizable 26-inch wheels that can handle rough terrain. I had very low expectations and hoped this bike would be even just okay, but it is amazing. I find it would be hard to go back to a normal bike after this. Next at number 9, we have Eurobike S LG6 Mountain Bike. While some folding bikes have very limited weight capacities, this Eurobike comfortably carries up to 320 pounds. It also accommodates a wide range of heights, from just over 5 feet to just over 6 feet. The bike also has a solid disc braking system compared to the traditional V-brake, so you can slow down quickly when you need to. It is a really nice bike, 
simple, and to the point. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Columba PR20 Sewn Folding Bike. Need a bike to get you to the store and back? The Columba is perfect for you. This bike gets props for its small profile and simple features, but you'll still enjoy six speeds and handlebar brakes, along with an adjustable seat and handlebars. This is a great bike. I like to put it in the trunk of my car. That's all for today. We upload fitness product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.